not only do you have females within the sisterhood waking up to their female nature and exploring that, but the world is shaking us up too. The world is shaking up the sisterhood circle too. So where it's like, bitch, you can't survive like this. You can't sustain for too long like this. You're going to need. Hold on. Shit. You're going to need to be under the leadership of a man. You're going to need it. It is going to be a necessity to survive. That's happening right now in real time. You're going to need a man that can work or at the very least has his ducks in a row to where he has been working for him or his money working for him. Something that's happening now. And a lot of y'all are going to be shook up by that to where it's like, Hold on. I can't survive like this on my own. Not without selling ass. Not without being a cash app coochie queen. Not without being a stripper or something. I, like, I can't do this by myself. Not without degrading myself. Now, I understand a lot of y'all don't mind being some high class hoes. I understand a lot of y'all don't mind. But guess what? That shit is going to catch up to you too. And a lot of y'all are not telling y'all sisters about that fact and that reality. Let's talk about it. I know a lot of y'all within the sisterhood are taught that it's okay to be a high class hoe. But that shit is not cute. And it catches up to your ass. Whoopsie. Get over here. And they have y'all really out here believing, oh, yeah, girl, I really don't need no man. All y'all do is be a cash app coochie queen, pop that pussy for a real nigga, you know, be out here on the pole, about to be a stripper, you know what I'm saying, about to be only fans and my room. And I, can, I don't really need no man. I can work my nine to five and do that on the side, you know what I'm saying? I know they have y'all really out here believing that shit is sustainable and maintainable. And guess what? Guess what happens? Female nature undefeated again knocks on your damn conscious. That's what happens. And it's like, bitch, you selling your soul. Yeah, you got you got a few a few cash apps. Yeah. You got a little pocket change. Yeah, you able to pay your phone bill and a little bit of your rent. But bitch, you're dying inside. The sisterhood don't tell y'all that part. They make high class hold'em look real lavish, real luxurious, but they don't tell y'all how much it diminishes your soul. They don't tell y'all that shit. Do y'all know how many of these quote unquote bad bitches out here being cash app coochie queens on the side while doing hair and makeup and nails or working a regular nine to five do y'all know how many of them are fucked up? They're alcoholics. They're addicts. They're depressed. They don't tell y'all that side of the coin. All they want to do is make it look real glittery. They're like, oh, yeah, I can live me a P-Valley life. You know what I'm saying? You know, I can be lavish. I can have my, my coins. I can be out here getting to it. They don't tell y'all how y'all cheaping y'all so y'all can't sleep that night. Do y'all know how many females I've seen like that? And I'm like, damn girl, I feel sorry for you, but hey, it's life you chose. We always got decisions. We always got choices. Sister Hill tells you, that's cute. You a boss bitch. You a strong woman. 
that shit always comes back to haunt you. Always. Stop letting the sisterhood lie to us. That's something else. That's another side of the coin that we don't explore when it comes to the sisterhood falling apart. It's females out here that were really under the false belief that, you know, I can be able to sell my body, sell my soul, and make it. And that will make me a strong, independent woman that once again did not need no man. And they're waking up realizing, damn, I got, I got all of this shit and I'm still unhappy. I feel like a, a cheap thrill. I feel like a fucking cheap piece of meat. I feel like a fucking prostitute because you are. Because you are. And sisterhood, again, they're going to lie to you, baby. They're going to lie to you and tell you, girl, we're free. We're women. We should be able to uh, live in our sexuality and be fluid and be open and be loud and be. That shit catches up to your ass, too. Sisterhood been lying to your ass. Telling you it's not going to have no effect. Please. Please. Again, alcoholics, drug addicts, depression. And all you had to do was swallow your female nature and get what you a solid ass man. And you had to do none of that shit. You had to sell your soul at all. Just have to be a woman and do what you were naturally designed to do and be. Please. Y'all, y'all hustling backwards, but that's what the sisterhood teaches y'all. It teaches you how to quote unquote win temporarily or win with great sacrifices, bars. This is what the sisterhood teaches. 